Congratulations, you guys. The new member of the family is a baby girl. Really? Thank you so much. I was really looking forward to meeting her. Haha, <laughs> the baby is so adorable. She will definitely be very beautiful when she grows up. Where are your husband and son? I just called him to let him know. He'll be here soon. Mom, we're here. Where is the baby? Samson, don't be so loud. We're in the hospital. Mom, we bought you flowers. Thank you. The bouquet is very beautiful. I like it very much. Mom, can we meet the baby now? I really want to see her. Sure, she over there. Please go out there and talk to her. Wow, she is so cute. Look at her hands. They look so tiny. So from today, we have become old brothers. We will have to protect her. Yeah, if anyone dares to bully her, I won't forgive them. Haha, <laughs> it seems like they love their sister very much. Have you two thought of a name for her yet? Yeah, I've been thinking for a while, and I want to call her Sophie. Sophie, I like that name. Then let's welcome Sophie home together. After that, Travis, Samson, and Dennis always dreamed about being loved by their sister. But things were not as they expected. Fifteen years later. Why are you so slow? If you don't hurry up, you'll be late for school. Yeah, today is your first day at this high school. You don't want to make a bad impression on people, right? We will take you to school. It's lucky that we finally study together. We are quite famous at school. I bet there will be many people who want to be friends with you. Ugh, you guys are so annoying. I will go to school alone. Don't you dare follow me. What are you talking about? How can we let you go alone? That's too dangerous. I'm 15 years old. I'm not a kid anymore. You don't need to be next to me all the time like that. Furthermore, after entering high school, I want you all to pretend you don't know me. What? Are you crazy? Why do we have to do that? You feel ashamed of us? No, it's because you guys are so famous. Do you know that girls in middle school always follow me around just to get your contact information? That's why I don't have any friends. So I won't let that happen again. But that's not our fault. Don't be so cold towards us. I don't care. If you don't do as I say, I won't talk to you anymore. What just happened? I heard Sophie scolding you guys. Did you do something to anger her? Mom, Sophie is really grown up. She doesn't like us anymore. She doesn't want to go to school with us. How could she treat us like that? When she was little, she always followed us. She also loves us very much. Why did she change like that? Haha, ha, she didn't do that on purpose. Don't forget that she also has her own life. There are also people she wants to be friends with. She can't be with you forever. I know you guys love her. But let her live and make all her own decisions. I understand, Mom. But we're still a little sad. Okay, it's not early anymore. You guys should go to school quickly. Yes, yes Mom. Mom. In Sophie's school. Wow, this school is really big. And there are also many beautiful girls. I wish I could be friends with any of them. Hi, I'm Tracy. Are you Sophie? I think we're classmates. Oh, hi. Nice to meet you. Today is the first day of school. Do you feel nervous? Um, I'm also quite worried. I don't know if I can make friends with anyone. So let me be your friend. That way you'll worry less. Are you serious? Yeah, of course. And you know what? In our school, there are three very famous guys. I heard they are brothers. And they are also very handsome and talented. I wonder if we will have a chance to meet them today. Really? I don't know that. Why does what Tracy just said sound so familiar? Please don't say those are my brothers. No way. That won't happen. But I have a bad feeling about this. Oh my god. Look, Sophie. Those are the guys I just mentioned. They are so handsome. Damn it. I knew right away it was them. What should I do now? Should I run away? No. 
I told them carefully when I was at home. Just act like I don't know them. Look, isn't that Sophie? Looks like she's already made friends. Aw, I feel so proud of her. Hey, should we go over there and say hello to her? No, she's looking at us with warning eyes. Have you forgotten what she said this morning? It's best we don't make her angry. So don't say anything. And just pretend you didn't see her. Okay, I understand. Then let's go quickly. Oh my god, Sophie. Did you see them looking this way just now? They must be looking at me, right? Yeah, you are beautiful like this. So I think they noticed you. Really? Do you really think so? Yeah, of course. Sorry, Tracy, but I can't say that's my brother. And the person they're looking at is me. Maybe I'll tell Tracy this truth after a while. For now, just keep it hidden. In Canteen School Sophie, these are the friends I told you about. And girl, this is Sophie, the girl I just met. Hi guys, nice to meet you. What is this, Tracy? Why are you suddenly friends with her? She looks so boring and nothing special. Or is her family rich? Do you get any benefit from playing with her? What? I? What are you guys talking about? Sophie is a very kind and friendly girl. She's so cute so I want to be friends with her. Don't say things like that anymore. Why are you acting so nice today? You're not always like this. I told you to stop. Or do you want to see me angry? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm just kidding. Haha, <laughs> Sophie, don't pay attention to what they say. They look so cruel, but they are actually good people. I bet you will like them after getting to know them better. Haha, <laughs> I know. I will also try to get to know them. Tracy is truly a kind girl. I feel like I can trust her. Maybe in the future I will tell her everything. That night. How was your day at school today? Is everything still going well? Yeah, I have made friends with a few people. Is that the girl standing next to you this morning? She is Tracy. She is very kind. I'm very happy to be friends with her. Ha ha, seeing you happy makes us happy too. What do you think about our performance today? We pretended we didn't know you at all. You guys did it well. Let's continue to do that from now on. What? Don't you want everyone to know about our relationship? No, that's a lot of trouble. I don't want to be bothered forever. My high school life has just begun. If you dare reveal that, I won't talk to you anymore. I have to go do my homework now. Bye. How could she say such cold words to us? Does she intend to pretend we don't exist? Come on, don't be so sad. You know we're the ones causing trouble for her. So just do what she says. Yeah, wait until she's ready to talk things out. We get to see her at home anyway. So don't think too negatively. Okay, I know. Sometimes later. Hayes, I haven't seen Travis, Samson and Dennis for a few days. Could it be that they are sick? Can I visit them? Nah, you don't need to worry. They're just focusing on exams. So they're always in the library. That's why you don't see them. How do you know that? Are you following them? Um, no, I just accidentally heard someone else say that. By the way, Tracy, I see you seem to like the three of them very much. Ugh, it's more like she's obsessed with them. She's always thinking of ways to start a conversation with them, but she is too shy to do so. Don't you think they are wonderful? They are both handsome and intelligent. I don't know if I had to choose. Which of the three should I date? Ha <laughs> ha Don't dream anymore. You won't have a chance to get close. Anyway, I haven't seen any of them have girlfriends. So any girl who can talk to them is very lucky. You don't know how loud they can be at home. Sometimes I don't even want to admit that he's my brother. But Tracy really likes my brothers. If I told her, she would probably be very happy. I have to tell her soon. Ugh, I finally finished cleaning the classroom. Tracy is busy today, so she can't stay with me. 
Looks like I'm the last one here. Hello, girl. It's time to go home. What? What are you doing? Why are you talking to me? What if someone sees? Don't stress too much. Everyone has gone home. We're the only ones left here. So no one will see it. Have you finished everything? Do you need any help? Nah, I'm done. Then let's go home quickly. Dad will be home for dinner today. Really? He finally returned from his business trip. Okay, let's go home. Meanwhile with Tracy. Ute, why did I leave my phone at school? I lied to Sophie and said I was busy today. So I wouldn't have to help her. I don't know if she's home yet or not. If she doesn't come back, it will be very awkward. Oh, looks like someone is coming out. I better hide. Sophie, stop teasing me. What? Is that Sophie? Why is she with them? They even look very close. How did she know them? She knows I likes them, but she still approaches them and doesn't tell me anything. That girl is really cunning. I have to expose her face. The next day. Tracy, why did you ask me out here? Where are Bambi and Cease? Aren't those two coming with you? Who did you go with after school yesterday? Huh? What do you mean? Yesterday, I... Oh God, yesterday I went with my brothers. Why would she ask this? Could it be that she discovered something? No way, that can't be possible. Just pretend like I don't know anything. Why don't you answer my question? Are you hiding something from me? Please calm down. I don't understand anything you say. Yesterday I just walked home alone. You are lying. I saw you with my own eyes yesterday. Walking home with Travis and the others. How the hell are you supposed to talk to them? Do you dare take them away from me? Is this how you treat me when I consider you a friend? No, Tracy. Things aren't what you think. I can explain everything. Shut up, you b What else do you want to lie about? I warn you to stay away from them. If I see you get close to them again, I won't forgive you. They are my brothers. Travis, Samson and Dennis, they're all my brothers. We live in the same house. So that's why I went home with them. What? What did you just say? Are you their sister? You better not make up stories to trick me. No. What I said is true. I never lied to you. I've wanted to tell you this truth for a long time. I'm sorry for making you misunderstand like that. Oh my god, I still can't believe this is true. Are you really their sister? I'm sorry for treating you like that. You're not hurt anywhere, are you? Yeah, I'm fine. Now you're no longer angry with me, right? Of course, you didn't do anything wrong. It's all my fault. Haha, -ha, I thought she was just a useless person. But it seems that's not the case. Now I can use her to get close to Travis. Or I can talk to Samson. Maybe I'll have lunch with Dennis. If I date them, my reputation will increase. People will pay more attention to me. Oh my god, I'm really looking forward to that day. The next day. Sophie, I'm sorry about yesterday. Don't mention it again, I've forgotten it. Are you sure I'll be able to meet your brothers today? Yeah, I told them I would bring my friends to my house. I think they're waiting for us. Oop, I can't believe this is coming true. This is the first time I've talked to them. Do they like me and which one of them should I date? Or should I date all three at the same time? Haha. <laughs> What nonsense are you talking about? Don't be too stressed. Let's go inside the house quickly. Tracy, this is all my brother. And... Hello guys, I'm Tracy. I'm your fan. Well, up close, you guys look even more handsome than in the pictures. 
How could Sophie be your sister? She doesn't look pretty at all. Huh? Why do you say that? Our little sister is so adorable. Guys, she is just kidding. Don't make things so serious. Um, today, she and I plan to study in a group. So we'll use the living room to study. Does that bother you? No, it's fine. You just do what you want. We will sit in the backyard. If you need any help, just call us. I know. Thank you. Ooh, your brothers are amazing. This is a good opportunity for me to get to know them. I thought you said you wanted to come to my house to study. Oh, you are right. I almost forgot about it. We should also take out our books, right? Yeah, this is the first time having friends come to my house to play. So thank you for coming here. Haha, <laughs> you are welcome. Okay, let's learn together. 30 minutes later. Tracy, we've been studying for a while now. Are you tired? Do you want me to make you some snacks? Yeah, sure, I would love to. Okay, so please wait for me a bit. Oh my god, did she really bring me here just to study? What a waste of my time. I want to talk to Travis and the others. Looks like they're in the backyard. I have to go out there and talk to them. Hey, what do you guys think about Sophie's friend? I don't know, but I have a bad feeling about her. It felt like she didn't see Sophie as a friend. Does she have any bad intentions? We cannot say anything in advance. It's best to keep an eye on her for a while. Hello guys, what are you doing? Can I join you guys? Hung Tracy, right? Why are you out here? Have you and Sophie finished your homework? Nah, we are on a break. So I want to talk to you guys a little bit. I heard that you don't have a girlfriend yet. So what type of girl do you like? We haven't thought about that. We feel like now is enough. Come on, don't say that. It would be more fun if you had a girlfriend. I'm free this weekend. Let's go out together. I don't know which one of you to choose. So let's all come together. Um, shouldn't you go back to Sophie? She will be very confused if she doesn't see you. Just ignore her. Anyway, I came here just to see you guys. So what is your answer? Will you guys come to my appointment? We will think and answer you later. Now, please go inside first. Sophie is looking for you. Okay, then I will wait for your answer. Remember to call me. Oh God, did she just flirt with us? She even wanted all three of us to go out with her. Isn't she too greedy? At least she should only choose one person. What? That's not the main problem. Don't you find her very strange? It seems like she's just using Sophie to get close to us. And the way she talked about Sophie, as if she were just a toy to her. I think we should talk to Sophie about this. I don't want her to be taken advantage of. We should do something. That night. Sophie, what do you think about Tracy? I think she's a good person. She was the one who started talking to me on the first day of school. She also introduced her friends to me. I really like her. But what's going on? Why do you guys ask like that? Um, I find her a bit strange. Didn't you see her coming here but she wasn't with you and kept looking for us all the time? Besides, hearing what she said about you makes me feel uncomfortable. You're her friend. Why does she always look down on you? No way. That can happen. I think you guys misunderstood something. She just likes you guys so much. That's why she looks so excited. And what she said about me. I don't think she did it on purpose. You shouldn't trust her like that. What if she's just using you? Dennis, this is the first time I have a friend. So don't talk about my friend like that. I want to trust her. I don't want to talk about this issue anymore. I'm going back to my room. Did I make her angry? I just want the best for her. Don't worry, she is a smart child. She will understand what you say. 
I think we should keep a closer eye on Tracy from now on. A few days later. It's been a few days, but Travis hasn't replied to my message. Even Samson and Dennis are the same. Are they ignoring me? No way, no one can resist my charm. They're probably busy with something. Hi, Tracy. What are you doing? Sophie, what are your brothers doing at home these days? Are they busy with something? Huh? No. They just stay home and play games. What? So why don't they reply to my messages? I, I don't know. Shouldn't you tell them to check my messages? I'm your friend, don't you care about me? Or you don't like me clinging to your brothers? I never thought like that. I just don't interfere with their lives. I don't care. I want your brothers to pay attention to me. And you have to help me do it. Do you understand what I say? What? I? If you don't help me, then I don't need you anymore. Your only value is as their sister. Don't make yourself useless. I know. I will try my best. What's with that attitude of hers? She looks so scary. What should I do now? I don't know how to solve this. In Sophie's house. Sophie, what happened? Why do you look so worried? No, I'm fine. I'm just thinking random things. You don't have to hide from us. Are you having trouble? Tell us and we'll help you. Actually, this has something to do with Tracy. What? Is she bullying you? No, she wants you guys to go out with her. Did she force you to do this? I think she just wants to talk to you guys more. She is my friend anyway, so I want to help her. Can you guys help me this time? I know you guys don't like hanging out with strangers. But just this once, please help me. Sophie, that's not how friends ask for favors. She is controlling you. Besides her, there are still many people who want to be friends with you. You don't have to force yourself to be with her. She, she is not a bad person. She is the first friend I have. I don't want to doubt or think badly of her. I believe she will change. Okay, I see what you mean. We will help you this time. But if she makes unreasonable demands of you again, we're not going to let that go easily. I know, thank you. But don't be too harsh on her. Don't worry, we know what we need to do. She needs to know her place. And no one is allowed to mess with our sister. The next day. Ugh, what time is it? Why isn't she here yet? How much longer does she want us to wait? Is she playing a prank on us? Please be patient a little longer. If she doesn't show up, we'll go home. Oh, here you are. It's great to see you all there. Let's start playing games together. Besides, I'm so thirsty. One of you go buy me some water. Excuse me, what did you just say? You were 30 minutes late and didn't even say a word of apology to us. Now you still want us to buy you water? Come on, chill, boy. It's an honor for you to wait for me. You guys should appreciate it. Not everyone has the chance to hang out with me. Are you brainless to say such things? What? Don't forget we don't want to see you that much. Who do you think you are to say such things to us? If it weren't for Sophie, we wouldn't have met you. Moreover, don't use her to do whatever you want. She is our sister, not your servant. If you dare to make her sad, we will not forgive you. We came here just to tell you these words. Go play by yourself, and don't bother us. Okay, guys, let's go home. Oh my god, what the just happened? What is their attitude? How dare they look down on me like that? If you are not mine, I will destroy you. I will make you regret what you did to me today. The next day. What's going on? I see people keep looking at me. Did I miss something? Sophie, I can't believe you kept it that secret. Don't you consider us friends? Why didn't you tell us? What are you guys talking about? I don't understand. You don't have to hide from us anymore. We already know the three hottest guys in school are your brothers. Let us meet them. Yeah, 
I want to buy them gifts too. Please take it to them for me. How? How do you know this? I have not told anyone about this yet. Huh? Haven't you seen Tracy's latest Instagram post? She said everything. She even posted pictures of her hanging out with your brothers. She also said they were flirting with her. Is that greedy girl planning to take all three of them away? We won't let that happen. I also want to go on a date with them. Can we come to your house to play? Then we can meet your brother. Um, I think there is some misunderstanding here. Things are not what they seem. Where is Tracy? I want to see her. Why did she do this? Guys, are you okay? What is going on? What is your relationship with Tracy? Ugh, there is nothing between us. She made it all up. Because of her, we were bothered by one person after another. I feel so tired. Maybe it was after what we said to her that she did this. I have never seen anyone as mean as her. What about you, Sophie? Are you being bothered by anyone? Yeah, some girls came over to ask me questions. But at least for now, I'm fine. Have you met Tracy? Did she say anything to you? I'm still looking for her. I also want to know what she was thinking when she did that. I'm sorry because of me you guys got into this trouble. It's not your fault. You did nothing wrong. The one who is wrong here is Tracy. I will find her to talk clearly. I want to know why she did that. Where did she go? I looked for her everywhere but still couldn't find her. Even Bambi and Cease are nowhere to be seen. Could it be that the three of them are together? Really? Are you serious? I didn't expect you to dare to do that. Huh? Isn't that Bambi's voice? They are right around the corner. I have to see what they are doing. I can't believe you get to hang out with Travis, Samson, and Dennis. The three of them are the coolest guys in school. There are a lot of girls jealous of you. I know, my popularity is up. Now everyone admires me. But it seems Sophie doesn't know anything about this. I saw her running to find you. Haha, <laughs> you don't need to care about that stupid girl. I just want to use her. Huh? I thought you considered her a friend. You two always look close to each other. If she wasn't the younger sister of those three guys, no way I am friends with her. She looks so rustic and boring. I have been planning to kick her for a long time. But because she can still be used, I keep her by my side. Ugh, you are such a bad girl. Turns out what my brother said was right. You are such an ungrateful person. How dare you treat me like that? Sophie! Why, why are you here? What you just heard is not true. I was just kidding with them. That's enough. Do you think I'm stupid that you can fool me forever? What are you posting on Instagram? I trust you so I tell you that secret. And yet you reveal it to everyone? Come on, it's not a big deal. Sooner or later everyone will know. I just wanted to help you say it a little sooner. What about the rumor that my brothers are flirting with you? Are you delusional and making that up yourself? What? Is that news fake? Oh my god, are you lying, Tracy? No, don't believe anything she says. Really? So do you want to meet my brothers? They will be the ones to give you the most accurate answer. They may forgive you, but not me. How do you dare to mess with them? You, how dare you act like that to me? Don't forget that thanks to me you have friends. What do you think a useless person like you can do? No one will want to be your friend. Shut up. You have no right to talk to me like that. Aren't you the one who cares about your reputation more than anyone else? What if I expose what you posted as false? Let's see who is friendless by then. What? You? Tracy, you better apologize to her. I don't think she's joking. It would be embarrassing if this were revealed. Yeah, I'm sorry for treating you badly before. I am very sorry for my actions. From now on, we will not be like that anymore. I don't need your apology. You guys better stay away from me from now on. I don't want to see your faces again. And Tracy, 
I warn you, if you mess with me again, I won't let it go as easily as this time. I will make everyone hate you. Remember what I said. Here you are, Sophie. Are you okay? Why do you look sad? What happened? Did Tracy do something to hurt you? She is unacceptable. I have to go find her. Samson, I'm fine. I have solved everything. I slapped her and warned her not to bother us. What? What did you just say? You slapped her? Yeah, I can't let her take advantage of me forever. That's what she deserves. Wow, you're really grown up. You don't need my help anymore. Come on, don't treat me like I'm still a kid. But I'm still a little sad that my friendship ended like this. It's okay, girl. Everything is gonna be fine. Don't you still have us by your side? Yeah, we will be your brother and your friend. If you need anything, just tell us. We are always ready to help you. Haha, -ha, I know. Thank you guys so much. I'm so lucky to be your sister. Thank you for always being by my side. The end.